everybody, this is Nolan here, and welcome to another episode of Danganronpa. Welcome aboard my ark. Okay, so in the lapis in the last episode, what we did was we did the motive. And uh, the motive was McMonokuma told them that they were they all they had all lost their memories of Hope's Peak Academy and everything and their entire lives from like a couple years. And that's why they think they're freshmen. And so the motive is that he if they kill someone, then they get their memories back. But we all know that none of them are going to do it, right? Totally not. Obviously. Obviously not. No murder is ever going to happen. Yeah, no murder. Because everybody's smarter than that, right? I swear to God, I hope so. Okay, no, it's not going to happen. Okay, so we're going to go meet in the, uh... Holy crap, thank you, Nagito. Uh, what? I like that. I like whatever that is. <laughs> uh, can I see behind? Can I see behind you, sir? Can I, sir? Why am I short like Makoto? I'm like crotch level again. No. I'm crotch level. That's what I am. Okay, let's just, let's just go. <laughs> what? Am I? Well, I mean, I'm a little. Yeah. Okay. I'm like your height. Yeah. I mean, you're still a tad taller though. I'm chest level to you. I think he's literally just walking on his knees. I, yeah, that's what he's doing. I can just imagine him just like, yeah. <laughs> okay. All right, so, um, yeah, the restaurante. Sorry, I'm getting sidetracked. <laughs> okay, so we got more soda. <laughs> Several people were already at the restaurant. I, I only see three people, Hajime. Several people, dude. Several means, well, actually, several just means four, so he's close. <laughs> but nobody was talking, not a single word. While they sat there, the people who were late began to arrive as well. Loud. <laughs> yeah, that's several people. Yeah, wait. no. Is everyone here? Huh? Huh, it seems Fuyuhiko is not here yet. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe I already got killed. <laughs> ah, dead bodies already? No. Don't go killing people off. I saw him outside earlier. However, he told me he would not be joining us this morning. <laughs> Why does he have to act like a lone wolf at a time like this? Maybe... Could... could he be thinking up a plan to kill someone by himself? You must not! Kazuichi, you should... uh... you should no doubt your friend. Hey, hey, hey! Hey, well, he's Yaku... Yakuza, isn't he? Do, do you understand what that means? He's part of the Japanese Mafia! Hmm. I presume he's the kind of person who would not come even if we summoned him. That's fine. I guess it can't be helped. We should just talk among ourselves. Someone call- someone can fill him in later. Talk? What are we going to talk about? Rejoice. Rejoice. I have decided to throw a party tonight. Oh, I guess it's tonight. Okay. Huh? <laughs> a b b b party That's right. That's right. A huge party that will last from sundown to sunrise. What the- Party till the sun comes up? This is your leader. Just so we're clear, I will not allow any absences. Your attendance at this party is absolutely mandatory. <laughs> so they're gonna like pull him out, pull him out of their houses even if they don't want to go? <laughs> he just knocks. <laughs> oh god. <laughs> oh my gosh. It's I like can just imagine day. like they, they just like, nobody's home, reaches his hand, just crashes through the door, just pulls them out <laughs> through the door. Wait, by the neck? Their giant arm, his giant Fat arms reaching through. <laughs> All right, sorry. That's a terrible visual. Okay. Hey, hey. Now that's not time to talk about stuff like partying. <laughs> On the contrary. His big meaty hands there just is grabbing no... <laughs> onto the. Okay, sorry. There is no better time to talk about this. But still, we really shouldn't be partying. Wait. Um. Hold on. I agree with Biakua. It doesn't do us any good to stay bummed out like this. In fact, because of the situation we're in, it's probably best if we all strengthen our friendships with one another. <laughs> That's what you thought too, right? That's why you want to throw a party. Hmm. It doesn't matter why I'm doing it. Anyway, it is it is of visual importance that all of it is of vital importance. I think I have dyslexia today, everyone. Please <laughs> help me. <laughs> These glasses don't help. <laughs> that we all stay in one place tonight. You say that with such significance. It's all clear now. It's decided. We're having ourselves a party. What? Stop talking. 
If I thought that, I would have made that clear from the beginning. Excuse me, sorry, I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. I see. That's important to be flexible, little guy. Little guy? <laughs> 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 In situations like this, perhaps a diversion from all this is just what we need. Yahoo! Then let's party hard! Ah, uh, in that case, I'll put my amazing cooking skills on display for you guys. Mm. Where's, the, where's the party going to be held? With, uh, would this restaurant be okay? No, this won't do. We need a location that's impervious to interfere from others. Outsiders. Outsiders. <laughs> a place even Monokuma cannot enter. What we need is an enclosed space. Um, an enclosed space? If the restaurant won't do, then neither will the lobby. That's not nearly enclosed enough. Um, Nor will the cottages. With so many people, people, we would be uh, be pressed up against each other. But if you want to be pressed up against each other, then a cottage is clearly the best choice. Shut up! Pressing up against ladies without uh, sneaking abroad, the woman only train and drag. I feel so lucky. Because, okay, the last... The last series, you were the pervert, which was Toko, and now I am! I have to talk like, in a weird- oh god. There's something wrong with you. I can't believe how uncomfortable you are with saying your perverted thoughts out loud. <laughs> <laughs> I may be a pervert, but I'm the kind of pervert everybody likes. <laughs> Who else but Teru Teru? I know. He's freaking Frick Boy RD. He's Quagmire. Quagmire. <laughs> your confidence is seriously impressive. <laughs> Uh, then, how about that old-looking building near this hotel? Huh? That rundown place? You're right. Yeah, but if we do our best to clean it, I think it'd be perfect. Plus, it's basically the only place that meets our needs uh, for an enclosed space, right? However... Indeed. However, Monami has forbidden us from entering that old place. But nobody cares about her rules because she's a nice bunny. As I recall, it's the middle of being re renovated. <laughs> I have heard your conversation. Well, it, uh, it, it heard it all with my very own ears. I have, I have good ears, cause I'm a wabbit. A <laughs> wabbit? <laughs> oh, so you use your ears. That's strange. Huh? huh? Hmm. Then what is the reason for those surveillance cameras? Are they for Monokuma's eyes only? Hello? Aw, oh, she looks so disappointed. That's fine. Well, it is of no concern. We, we can settle that issue another time. Listen. Regarding the old building, you came to tell us something about it, right? <laughs> yes, if it strengthens everyone's bonds with each other, then I will not hesitate to cooperate. I shall allow it. So in that case, I will allow you to enter the old, build, old building. I'll cooperate so we can all party together. <laughs> together? That's not gonna happen, because you're so disgusting. Understand? Do yourself a favor and stay away from mirrors. You'll you be grossed out by what you see. Don't say that. Don't say that. Oh, your kind words make me want to cry. Wait, what? Mm. Kind words? She's so pure. Ah, uh, she's nice. Um, so we're all good with the old building? And? Then what about the preparations? If it's in the middle of renovation, don't we need to clean it first? I have never done the dirty work known as cleaning before. I am excited to finally experience it. Oh, uh, okay. I guess hey, hey, hey. she hasn't done a thing in her, uh, something like that in her life. No way! There's no way we could dirty our dear princess's hands! Aww. Yeah, I don't want to do it either. Jeez. What? Nobody's gonna do it. Alright, little guy. <laughs> Just freaking grabs Hajime's neck. <laughs> Alright, little guy. You're gonna it. <laughs> <laughs> Alright. Hey. His big meaty hand. Alright, sorry. Uh, in, in, in that case, why don't we decide a random by a random drawing? Random drawing? Actually... To be honest, I already prepared a drawing because I assumed something like this would happen. He's gonna like pull it out and it's gonna be his because he's so lucky. <laughs> Get it? Lucky? Yeah. Just joking. Okay. To go to the trouble of preparing this, just what did he think would happen? See? Whoever draws the chopstick with the red mark on it will be in charge of cleaning, okay? Does that sound fair? Judgment. Well then, let us entrust our destinies to the whims of this drawing. Right. Well, no hard feelings. One by one, everyone took turns pulling the chopsticks Nakito held in his hand. And when it was all said and done... What? Huh? I'm left with the red mark? Haha, <laughs> for someone called the ultimate lucky student, you don't seem very lucky right well, now. Well, it's lucky to be unlucky. Because <laughs> it's like a drawing. Oh. Hmm, I guess I, it can't be helped. All right. Well, if it's just cleaning, leave it to me. I'm actually pretty good at it. <laughs> I thought so. You seem like you'd make a good stay-at-home dad. Rude. 
<laughs> I think. I'll take that as a compliment. Okay. For me, I take that as rude because it's like... Anyway, I'll handle the cooking. Well, of course you will. All right. First, I need to prepare my ingredients. Then I'll start cooking at the old building. There's no mistaking I, Teru Teru Hanamura, will go all out. I will prepare the world's tastiest dishes for all for for you all. Then, then I just need to pass along the party details with to Fuyuhiko. Let's go about our business then. After Monokuma's not nightly announcement, we'll all meet at the old building. Okay. <laughs> After everyone left, I decided to go back to the cottage. There's still some time before the party. There's no way I can spend it just staring into space in my room. Well, since I have time, some free time, it'd be better if I went and talked to everyone. Free time already? Okay. Oh, what items do you have left? So, so we don't have really any coins or anything. Be well, can we, we can't, we're not at the old building yet, so we can't do any of that crap. Well, so we what have items two do items have? left. Oh, <laughs> never mind. <laughs> Why is he next to me? Okay, ding dong. Ding dong. Who is? Uh, Who is it? It's me, your old pal, uh, somebody. Hajime. Okay. <gasps> oh. What's the point of searching for what this means? We should be searching for a way to safely escape this place with everyone. What should I do? Should I invite Byakuya to hang Did out? Did you say you saw something? Yeah. Wait, what'd you see? At the window. Should we... You know what? I'm gonna... Yeah, let's quickly do that. What's that? Oh my gosh. Hmm, I guess there was another oh. hidden monokuma. Oh. A sixth one. What? A sixth one? Yeah. I what? thought there were five. Oh, we can And go you got ten monocoins! Yay! Listen. Yeah, um, uh, Okay, yeah, let's just give him the present real quick. <clears throat> <laughs> I will continue to search for clues, but I won't stop you from following me. I spent time with Byakuya today walking around the island. Looks like Byakuya let me get a little closer to him. Yes. Let's, if he likes the, uh... He likes... 50. Oh, wait, 50. 50, 50, 50. Usually I don't pay attention to such an ob ob obvious attempt at currying favor. Rejoice. But this item has significant value. In my mind, your stock has increased trem tremendously. Hey, Hajime, let me ask you one thing. Huh, me? I don't really mind, but... There's something I've been wondering for a while, and I'd like to purge that question from my mind. Listen. So let me ask you. What is your body fat percentage? What? Why does he care? I guess it makes sense, uh, but what? Well, I don't really know the exact number. I've never had it checked before. What? Never had it checked before? This can't be! Are you saying you have no intention of understanding the ratio of fat stored within you? Sure. I swear, this is why I dislike commoners. Wow. Wow. For some wow. reason, Byakuya's mood seems abnormal. I'm starting to think I've actually done something wrong. I see. However, just by looking at you, I'd say you are a 9, no, maybe an 8. <laughs> Regardless, it's probably around one digit. <laughs> Be grateful this is a tropical island. If you were somewhere less hospital, you'd freeze to death. Uh, I see. <laughs> anyway, you still can't remember what your talent is? Yeah, not yet. Don't worry. I see. However, there is no need for you to be so depressed about it. Huh? What's with that face? Nothing. I just thought I was gonna get yelled at again. <laughs> How foolish. Do you really think I get mad about something like that? A person like me has a responsibility to watch over you weaklings. <laughs> Besides, as long as I'm here, it doesn't matter what your talent is. In the name of as long name. as I, Byakuya Togami, is in charge, you will know all peace. Thank I see. you, I guess. <laughs> His personality is so overwhelming. <laughs> the Togami Corporation is famous worldwide, but it will grow even more rapidly under my command. He said that before, didn't he? Yeah. You shall. F you should feel lucky that someone as talented as me is. That's Listen, yeah. Blah. Is here. Yeah. yeah. Just believe in me. If you do, everything will turn out fine. I don't really understand, but he's extremely confident. So this is Byakuya Togami, the ultimate affluent progeny. Hmm. Just make sure you don't get in my way. A commoner should know their place and stay put. Goodbye. However, if there's anything troubling you, I don't mind if you rely on me. After saying that, Byakuya gallantly strolled away. He was being petty. He was being pretty condescending, but he doesn't seem like a bad guy. No, he was. Kind of. But he's fine. 
Remember when he tampered with Chishiro's evidence? Yeah, that was terrible. Because he was like, this is boring. Anyway. Yeah. I feel like I got to know a little bit more about Biakula. He Byakula. touched a dead body, too. That was gross. Okay. And he complained about Kyoko touching dead bodies. Well, fine. Anyway. I decided to return to my room for now. Oh, he's a hypocrite. He complained oh, yeah. about Kyoko touching dead bodies, oh, and then right. he did that. Oh, right. He is a hypocrite. Well, we got like one, two, three, four. There's nine. still some time left. I feel restless. Maybe I should go for a walk. Oh, it looks like there's room for like two more. Yeah. So we got two more Monokuma plushies. And then that's the one, two, three, four, five. Okay, so next time, try to for don't forget that there's... Don't, just try to get all of them on the yeah. list, because I don't want to miss any. I want to try to get all of them. That would actually be kind of cool. I've never... Well, you've, I've never 100 percented something in a you've game. You've never been a completionist. Guess what, Nolan? This is your first time. <laughs> okay, so let's go to the Mono Mono machine. Oh, oh, a carrot. I got a carrot. What the frick is that? <laughs> Obtained. Oh, I know he loves that. That has to be the silver ring. That's everything. Let me look at Nagito's account. I should probably get going. Okay, so. Oh, oh, let's see if you get the carrot. Oh, she likes it. I think. She likes it. Oh, hope meter. Hope meter went up, guys, by the way. Okay. Okay, let, I'll, ch I'll frequently check up on it. Anyway, so... We're gonna talk to Mahiro. Gundam. Okay. Oh, wait, hey, no! Hey. I want... I want to go talk to Usami. Remember? I want to get some of my skills. Yeah, check your report card. Uh... Hold on. So I got... A lot of skills. Holy crap, that's a lot. So, Wait, no, I, you only start getting- you, you already have one skill with everyone based on the introductions. You start getting skills when you get like two of them. So I have one, two, three. Three. Alright, go talk to Usami, right there. Oh, what? Oh, wow. Oh, wow. Oh, I can't- oh. Nah, is it worth- should I just save up? If you want to. Because I have one, two, three, right? Yeah, I have three. So if I- I can do that, yeah. Okay, anytime I want to travel somewhere, I can just go into my report card and do it. I'll talk to her first and save up for the four. Well, this is a party. I definitely want to take some good photos to remember it by. Come on! Just leave it to me. I'll make sure to take perfect shots with this camera. What should I do? Should I invite Mahiro to hang out? Ah, are you interested in cameras? Do you want me to teach you a little bit about them? Sadly. <laughs> I spent time listening to Mahiro lecture me about different types of cameras. It looks like Mahiro and I grew a little closer. It was a silver ring, right? Yeah. Okay, she loves it? Yeah. Thank the lord. Okay. Good, good, good. C can I really have this? Thank you. Thanks, Hajime. I'll make sure to take good care of it. Hey, hey! Uh, Hajime, stay there. Right there. Hmm? Say cheese! Say cheese! Just kidding! Just kidding. The shutter went click. I guess Mahiro wanted to take a picture of me. <laughs> So I can save it in my room when I every time I go to bed I can look at you. Okay, anyway. Oh no. <laughs> well, I guess this is good enough. Yep, that is sure is a dumb looking face. Wow, rude. Alright. Dumb looking face? That's only because you took my picture so suddenly. Just so you know, it's not like I want a picture of you or anything. I swear to every god who's listening, that's true. That's... it's, it's just a record. You don't have to go that far. But what kind of record? Hmm. A record is just a record. I want a record that right now, we're all living together in this place. We're living together? It's pretty simple, but in this situation, it's easy for us to forget that, you know? Come on! So I decided to make a record of everyone each day so that we won't forget. That's pretty much the only thing I can do right now. I see, that's a good idea. I seriously wouldn't have thought to do something like that. Makiro seems like a really solid person. Hmm. But, taking pictures of guys isn't fun, so I guess it'll be fine if I only do that once every three days. You're already contradicting what you just said. Well, aren't you commendable? It's so awesome that your priorities are in check. What's going on? What does that mean? <laughs> huh? Is she, like, illiterate? <laughs> Aww. More importantly, we've- we got this- <sighs> Go ahead. <sighs> refreshing. More importantly, we've got this blue sea and white beach, but it's weird that but it, it, that weird stuffed animal just ruins it. 
No matter how beautiful the scenery is, if the subject's face doesn't stand out... Hey. Oh, I know. If you ever see Monokumu again, capture him. I can take pictures of Monami just capture fine, <laughs> but he if he sees what I try to do every time... He sees what I try to do every time. One day, I'll definitely capture him with my viewfinder, and I'll be world famous for landing such a huge scoop. <laughs> well then, I'm busy, so I guess I'll see you later. After controlling so much of the conversation, Makiru suddenly changed the subject and walked away. Was she angry or something? Did I say something weird? This is bad. I have no idea what's going on. My errors report card been updated yet. Alright, cool. I should return to my room at once. Okay, two more Monokuma plushies. We're good. Ding dong, bing bong. <laughs> Nice. <laughs> Thanks. Good night, he says. Whatever, I have a party to attend. Alright, time to go to buy the old building at by the hotel. Good night, he says. <laughs> oh, okay. Getting cocky, are we? Okay, so now I can go to my report card. And so basically what I can do is get my skill that I actually want. So what I'm gonna do is this this is worth four. So which one would be good? Oh wait, it doesn't even tell us. What? Does it tell us a Wait, wait, click on it. See what happens. There you go. Oh, okay. So it says, Attentive influence. Slightly increases influence gauge. Oh, that's good. That's definitely good. Okay. Let's just trade it in. Yay! We got it, guys! We got the first skill! We got the first skill! Before the first chapter started! Which is good! Very good! Okay. Wait, remaining. 15? What? No. That's just the amount of skills we're in. Wait, wait, wait. Check, actually. Oh god, yeah, you actually do have 15 skills from all the things you got from people. What the fudge? Go on a spending spree. Okay. So extraordinary focus, what does that do? Okay, so it says slightly increase the focus gauge effective during the class trial. Uh it's one of is it is it more of just like I think the mouse thing? So oh, your influence gauge is your health, the focus gauge is the green bar. You want that. You, you want definitely that want your influence gauge. I mean your focus, focus gauge. gauge. Should you we do want... that? Yes. Okay, <laughs> we're just gonna get like how Lost. much? How much are there? Oh, there's not a lot actually. Com I mean, considering. All right, lost in thought. Uh, slightly increase the time limit for. Oh yeah. Time limit. Oh, more we want time. We want more. You get time. more time. Yeah. For each phase. The trial. Heck yeah. Okay. Charisma. I mean, I have enough for one. Increases more. influence gauge recovery. That means when you, uh, when your uh, health recovers, when you do something right, it'll recover it more. Mmm. That's do important it. to get. That's important. And there you go. That's all and you I can, can get. And I can like, and I keep them, right? I don't even have to like equip them anymore. Do I? No, you still have to equip them. For God. Wait. So I don't. Okay. So we have. Let's count how many we have left. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen. 16 left, which isn't actually bad. I mean, if we get, well, if we get about two per, hmm, we probably won't get them all, but we'll get very close, so I know that, which is good. Okay, all right, <clears throat> so, uh, let's, uh, let's get out of here. Go to the old building, apparently. All right, so there's an old building. Where would that be exactly? <laughs> uh, remember, it's by the hotel. Oh, right, right, okay. Oh, wow. This thing. Yeah. Okay. So this is the old building. Compared to the hotel, it definitely looks worse from the for the wear. You're here. Now then, stand up straight and raise your arms. Why do I have to do that? Because I need to do a body check. A body check? Why does he care so much? Since I'm the one hosting oh, the party, it's necessary for me to take all possible oh, security I measures. I thought you meant, like, body check, like, how, how, what's your weight again? <laughs> Listen. I already promised I would not allow even one person to become a victim. I, I get it. And so I reluctantly laced my arms and stood up straight. The Akiwa went ahead and thoroughly searched me. Starting off my legs and working his way up. I see. It appears you haven't brought anything dangerous. That's good. Very good. Uh, of course I haven't. That's fine. Very well. I shall allow you to enter. Hmm? It was at that moment when I noticed a strange item near where Byaku was standing. It was that moment. He knew. He freaked up. <laughs> Metal cases? What? Dorlimonum, actually. I found them at the supermarket. This one is used to storage any dangerous items I find during the body checks. The other one is for... 
Well, let's just say it's for emergencies only. What do you mean, emergencies? Don't worry about it. The others are already here, gathered at the dining hall in the back. Go there and wait. As soon as he said that, Yakuwa turned his back to me. I guess that's the end of our talk, but... He's so cautious. I didn't expect him to perform a body check. And what do you mean by emergencies only? Hold on. Let's check our pet again. Apparently. Uh... Yeah, she's fine. Okay. Uh, Alright, so... Whoa. What are you doing here? Oh, there's a st uh, tantalizing aroma wafting from the kitchen. Jeez. However, Biaccio will yell at me if I don't go straight to the dining hall. You should ho uh, head over there as well, little guy. <laughs> Hello, little guy. <laughs> Alright, uh... Kitchen. Oh, wait, dining hall. Frick. Ah, there it is. Okay. Ooh, boy. Oh, look at all that food. <laughs> uh, Hajime, how do you like it? What do you mean? See, I de decorated the whole dining hall for the party. I even laid out the carpet, too. Really? Even the carpet? Yep. Yep, I brought it from the supermarket. That place sure seems to have everything. It does, doesn't it? I actually want to cover the whole floor, but I guess the carpet isn't big enough. <sighs> There's a lot of dust and cobwebs all over the place, too. It took me all day to clean the dining hall just because of that. There's no way I can handle being stuck cleaning the whole day. You're commendable, Nagito. Thanks. Yeah, thanks. Excuse me. Both a blessing and a curse to be commendable. Okay, um... Let's see here. Um... Are we just talking to everyone? Just investigate. There's there a are a lot of, of fancy-looking party dishes on the table towards the front. Okay. Uh... And yes, talking to people counts as investigating. Oh, okay. Hey! Uh, oh, hey, what's, what's up? Ew. God. It's pointless. She's completely focused on the food. Man, that was so uncomfortable. Getting groped so thir uh, thoroughly by a man that was my worst nightmare. Oh, you mean the body check. How annoying. Plus, he got super pissed and started yelling at me when he noticed that was a wet, uh, had a wrench with me. Seriously, how frigid annoying. It's your fault for not have, for having a wrench in the first place. Man. It just happened to find, I just happened to find out at the airport. Carrying it around calms me down. Bia, but Biakua put it in that, uh, dur, duralum, duralum in case of his. Aw, man. Sniffle. <laughs> okay, uh, Gundam. Good instinct. Even though that man is a lowly worm, it appears his cooking skills is our most impressive indeed. Nevertheless, even his food cannot stand against the gourmet cuisine of the multiverse. Uh, yeah. I don't want him to die because of that reason. I don't want Terror Terror to die because I want I want to be eating food. I would I mean I wouldn't want him to die because I'm not playing the game. But anyway, I'm not in the game. Okay. That creepy Akua rubbed his ham hands all over me and called it a body check. More like sexual harassment. What? Th that's not what it is. He did the same thing to the guys, too. <laughs> so, I feel like I was getting... F he was getting frisky while he was frisking me. <sighs> she's like Toko, kind of. A little bit. <laughs> yeah. Kind of. Yeah, I'm, in, I'm petty and no, pretty she's... in demand, you know. Uh, she's not. Never mind. She's, <laughs> she's, she's kind of, but she's not. Because she's not, like, shy. You're just kidding. Okay, uh... Oh, yay! It's it's the girl that we all love, kind of. Okay, um... I'm worried about Monokuma showing up. If he finds out we're having a party, there's no way he'll leave us alone. So... We gotta do something about it. You're right. We should do, we should do something. I wonder if someone can do something about it. Hmm, I wonder. Hmm. I wonder. So we're on the same page, then. I'm not sure I understand. <laughs> hmm, I'm not sure I understand. Sorry. Now I understand. Now I understand. Right. This old place sure is run down. I feel bad Nagito went through all now this trouble I cleaning it. Now I understand. Even cleaning has its limits. See, check the f check out the floorboards. Maybe the wood shrank because of the deterioration? Don't these openings seem dangerous to you? You're right. Aww. Well, the carpet is spread out enough to cover most of the floor, so I guess it won't be that big of a deal. But it might be best to tell Mikan to be careful. Yeah, she is the type to trip over nothing. Yeah. Uh. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Even though it took me the entire day just to... 
Okay. <laughs> um. Uh, where? <laughs> Do I, am I allowed to leave? No. Oh, press, okay. press tab. What else is there to investigate? Oh my god. Oh, well, well. There are a lot of tasty looking party dishes. Is there anything else? No, I'm, I've talked to- oh. Such a big table. Will the dishes be placed here too? Excuse me? <laughs> iron plates? That reminds me, I saw some similar looking iron plates in the hallway too. But why are there iron plates bolted into the walls? Yeah, why would there be? All is not what it appears to be. Huh? Stay back. One of my four dark devas, Supernova Silver Fox Sandy, has been seen what lies shrouded amidst the darkness. Though that iron plate appears to be bolted into the well wall, it's actually bolted over what's known as a window. Window? That's me what's too. a window? There are no <laughs> windows in the dining hall at all. I assume these iron plates are covering them. But why are iron plates covering the windows? The night is my domain. Hmm. Sandy, it appears your fur is rustling more than usual today. Hey, what iron? Why are the iron plates covering the windows? Let's make history. Such a fine day. Countless lives gasp at the first breath, and countless more go out to all the way of the flesh. I guess he doesn't know. Oh, uh, yeah. <laughs> well, this building is in the middle of renovation, so I guess that might have something to do with it. Is that it, his way but... of saying no? <laughs> <laughs> this place sure has a creepy atmosphere because of that. Suddenly, we heard the voice of the ultimate affluent progenist ring through the dining protagonist. hall. Protagonist. Protagonist. What? What? Oh. Oh, I guess. Okay, I guess it's like... A... Okay. Thank you for waiting. Hmm. Teru Teru is in the kitchen, and it appears for Yuhiko to not come. I apologize. I apologize. I did inform him about the party, but... Jeez. It's not like you to apologize, Pekko. It's his fault for not coming. I explicitly stated that attendance was mandatory, but... It's fine. It's just one less person is absent. That shouldn't pose a problem. He won't be able to do anything. Mm -hmm. What do you mean by that? What? More importantly... Come on. Hey, what is that? An intense expression spread across Byakuya's face as he looked at the table of various food dishes on it. Dangerous! As he stomped his way towards the table. Hey, what are you doing? Oh my god. No, I'm not. No, I'm not. <laughs> no. He's like brushing his teeth with it. <laughs> He's like what you say? You're totally pigging out. That's just no, I'm not. <laughs> I'm telling you, I'm not. Look carefully at this dish. Oh, he's like Bowser when he like eats all that food in Bowser's Inside it looks Story. Like delicious roasted meat. Delicious roasted meat, little guy. What is that? The big guy. <laughs> oh. Terror, terror, poison the food. It's an iron skewer. That's right. This iron skewer is definitely a dangerous item. I must take full responsibility and collect it. Okay. <laughs> Oh, little guy. No, I'm not. <laughs> no, I'm not. He's like brushing his teeth with the freaking drumstick. Hey, looks like everyone's here. I should go ahead and bring out the rest of the, uh, huh? Oh. What? Some messy eater ruined my arrangement. Hmm. Who made this dish? Well, of course um. he did. Uh, that would be me. But, um, are, are you a food critic? What are you thinking? What are you plotting? Cooking with such dangerous items? No, 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 no. The no, dangerous? No, no. That's chur churrasco. It's a South African meal where you stab meat on an iron skewer to cook it. Mm. It felt really tropical and exotic, so I thought it would totally fit the party's atmosphere. <laughs> These iron skewers are a problem. Why? Eh? Iron skewers aren't allowed either? If that's how you're acting, then there might be more skewers than just these. Hey, Hajime, come with me. I need your help. But why me? Why does he always pick the protagonist to help him? Man. It's your fault for standing right in front of him. My, my condolences. Frick, okay. Byakuya's face bore an intense expression as I reluctantly follow him to out to the dining hall. Out of the wait. <sighs> That's okay. Uh I'm gonna have to stare at these words. What do you have to say about all this? Alright, this is the kitchen. We have to thoroughly expect it to make sure there are no dangerous items. Thoroughly, huh? Byakuya stomped to the kitchen, and I followed after him. Uh, another investigation no, sure. <laughs> Let's get on with it then. Search this place thoroughly. As he issued out that order, Byakuya began searching the whole kitchen from one end to the other. Hmm. 
Look, I found these. There are forks and knives on the shelf. <laughs> forks and knives in a kitchen? What? <laughs> Don't tell me those two. Naturally. These are definitely dangerous items. If you're just eating, chopsticks are enough. Oh, well. After he said that, Byakua threw the forks and knives <laughs> into the Dorylon case, one after the other. <laughs> you're he being starts very... eating them. <laughs> no, I'm not. <laughs> <laughs> okay. You're being very thorough about this. Uh... Okay. There appear to be various types of knives. Out of the question, knives are far too dangerous. <laughs> Interrupts him. Hand them over to me, I'll safeguard them. He's the like, grab the knife from my hand. Shoves it into his body the fat. With the rest. I'll safeguard them, just freaking. <laughs> he just absorbs them. Just absorbs it in his body. That's disgusting. <laughs> of course. Of course. Uh, 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 <laughs> uh that's disgusting though. Uh, okay, absorbs them. All right, let's see what this is. Chinese, Japanese, French, and Italian cuisine. Seafood dishes too. There's even a huge piece of meat on the bone. That teru teru, he sure got fired up. I don't even know if I'd be able to eat that much food. See. It seems there are no dangerous items, like that skewer and the sarasa earlier inside that pile of food. That appears to be the case. Phew, I wouldn't have known what to do if he said fish bones and meat bones were also dangerous items. What? what? <laughs> uh, even glasses though too, right? Uh, what? What's that? What? Oh. Um, this paper is... I see. I see. It appears to be equipment list for the kitchen. 20 forks, 20 knives, 20 spoons, 5 iron skewers, 3 frying pans, 20 wine glasses. There are also iron plates for barbecue, and even a portable stove for cooking hot pots. Hmm. Iron plates and a portable stove. I do recall seeing them on a shelf over there. This kitchen seems to be well kept. There should be no problems using it. Though the building is old, the kitchen is impressive. Compared to the normal restaurant, it's not too shabby. Very strange. But it's strange. One of the items on this list seems to be short by one. Uh... Check the list. Oh, right. Okay. <laughs> 24, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20. Oh. Hmm. Yeah, okay. Very... Uh... Tab, or... Maybe just talk to him? Hey, is it necessary to go Don't this far? I'm doing this because it's necessary. If I'm to fulfill the promise I made to not let anyone become a victim, I must be extra vi vigilant. Really? Is that all? What? He's paranoid. What I mean, do you mean? That's a good thing. Well, I'm just assuming, but I think something must have happened to you. After all, you decided to throw a party so suddenly, I can't help but think there's a reason for that. Hmm. That's not it. I've become a dis- I've been a distrustful person for as long as I can remember. Distrustful person? <sighs> I don't really like to talk about my past, but it's fine. I'll just tell you a little bit of it. I cannot talk to others about my past. I suspect that my skeptical nature is partly to blame. Blame. The Akua has a past you can't talk about? Hmm. Distrusting others and being distrusted in return. For a long time, my life has been a living hell. It was inevitable that I would end up this way. <laughs> but in this kind of situation, my skeptical nature might be of good use. If we're to survive here, skepticism is necessary at all costs. By the way, that past you mentioned, now is not the time. However, one day, there will definitely be a time when I will tell you all about it. Hmm. If nothing happens and time passes for us peacefully, I will have no choice but to talk. Th that sounds pretty deep. I sort of feel like things are even more mysterious now because he, has, he hasn't told me the whole story. This guy... Might have had a deep mystery hidden with him, within him, deeper than I thought he'd have. Silly talk. Hey, enough of the unnecessary banter. We better hurry and find the rest of those dangerous items. Yeah, got it. Even so, he sure works us hard. That's probably more in the line of with his actual personality, I bet. Huh? huh? <laughs> <laughs> Why? What? The kitchen is a mess? No, the kitchen's a mess. What happened here? Stop talking. Don't raise your annoying voice. I just removed all the dangerous items. Huh? There are no knives or forks? Why? How come? Don't make me repeat my I thing. literally just said that I removed all the dangerous items. Don't tell me. You're treating cooking utensils like a dangerous item? No, 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 no. Well, no, no. most of the dishes are finished. So all I got to do is arrange the plates, so it's not a problem, but... But, but still. Wow, Hajime. S stop, stop it! Get off of me! What the... Eh... Eh? Not, uh, not into that sort of thing? Well, that's a little depressing. Trust me, I'm the one who's depressed here. Hey, 
Before you start getting all flirty, explain Wait, this. Wait, what was he trying to do? I think it was like, Hajime. No. No. I checked the equipment list, and there seems to be one iron skewer missing. Ah, oh, that's right. As far as I know, that's been missing from the start. No matter how clean this place gets, stuff is still bound to go missing in an old building, right? If it's been missing all along, we can't really do anything about it, right? You're right. There's no place to hide such a lawn skewer anyway. Very well. All I need to do is keep a watchful eye. Don't tell me you plan to keep a watchful eye let's all go. night long. Alright, let's go back. The others should be waiting for us. You too, Teru Teru. Come to the dining hall for now. <laughs> okay. Jeez, he's such a pushy leader. Well, there's a reason for that. <laughs> Ah, they're finally back! Hey, hey! Hey, let's eat already! I'm starving! Hmm. There's still an issue we need to address first. Rise. Eh, an issue? Oh, right. We gotta go- Uh, wh who- who do I gotta beat the crap out of? Just say the word! I'll do- I'll do it for you. That's enough. That won't be necessary. The issue is here- The issue is where to safeguard the Sterlumium case that has all the confiscated dangerous items. Huh? Can't we just leave it here? Hmm. I've already put a lock on the case, so it shouldn't be a problem, but we should we should definitely keep up with security and keep it somewhere safe. Um... Uh, someplace safe? Oh, wh there's a storage room at the back of the old building. Let's see. A storage room, huh? Even so, we can't leave the case alone in there. Then... Then someone should guard it. That, that would keep it safe, yes? Aww. Eh, hoo-hoo. I'll do it, of course. Eh? Are you sure? I guess if you were just, just kidding! But it'll be lonely there by yourself! You're drinking a lot of water? Yeah, I, I'm talking so much. Uh -huh. I don't mind. I'm really not good in situations where I have to be around lots of people anyway. Yaha! <laughs> <laughs> if I wrote a sound about this, the title would definitely be Lonely Girl in the Storage Room. However... However, Teru Teru has gone through the trouble of cooking. Is it alright if I bring some of it with me? Okay. Yeah, that's totally fine. But if you're going to go to uh, do guard duty anyway, it might be better if you just avoid the storage room. Eh? Why is that? Well, not only the storage room packed with lots of stuff, it's hard to see if they're as full of cobwebs. Also, also, I was so busy cleaning the dining hall that I didn't even have time to go clean the storage room. If you just stayed in there for a long time, I think it would be bad for your health. I see. In that case, why don't you guard it in the office? If I recall correctly, there's also a circuit breaker in there, too. It'd be a good idea to guard that as well. Yep. Yeah, the office sounds nice. I'm pretty sure it's not that dirty, either. Understood. Understood. So I need to be on guard duty at the office. Then, I should get going. Have fun tonight, everyone. Taking with her the Duralimum. The Duralimum case. Duralimum? Duralimum. There we Duralimum go. case and a <laughs> plate filled with food. Pekko left the dining hall. I see, I see. Mmm, seeing Pekko's back as she walks away makes me feel like she's getting, she's got this super cool, melancholy vibe. Makes me hungry mungry. Huh? <laughs> but shouldn't she have taken the other case of her too? <laughs> this, no, this case is fine. That's weird. Ah, uh, no fair. You're like the only one who got to bring their own stuff. Naturally. When you're as special as me, you get special privileges. <laughs> special privileges. VIP privileges. <laughs> When you put it that way, it's hard to argue with you. What? <laughs> Excuse me. I mean, I, I, uh, oh, I admire your enthusiasm, Listen. but... The Duraluminum case stays with me at all times. I mean, he's easy going? I put the key to the other case in here as well. I will take full responsibility for watching over it. There's no way I can let anyone else handle this matter. More importantly, we're all done now, right? Let's start the party. No, there's still more. Uh, who, uh, who do you want me to beat the crap out of? Hurry up and tell me already. Seriously, it has nothing to do with that. Hmm. Actually, if you're volunteering, I do have one particular nuisance in mind. Hajime, I'm just joking. Huh? Are you talking about... Right. Monokuma, of course. He's the one thing that should obviously disrupt this party. I'll show you my serious All right, side. all right. <laughs> yeah, so you'll let me eat, eat if I beat the crap out of Monokuma, right? Hold on. Wait a sec. If you actually pick a fight with that thing... You're just gonna going to end up uh, perforated. Perforated. Are you telling me uh, to wait till I starve to death? S starve to death? That's a little extreme. Is that is that a fine voice? Probably. Yeah. Our opponent is not someone we can just fight. Rather, it's better if we use our heads and think of a plan. Hey, hey. 
I'll, I'll do something about it. What? Do something? You? A <laughs> surprise. Hey, hey. Hey now, what can a girl like you do? You're just gonna put yourself in danger. Nope. I won't. It's not like I'll personally do something. You won't? <laughs> do you intend to utilize Monomi? Yep. Yeah, if I can talk her in into helping us, she might be able to keep Monokuma at bay. At least, that's what I think. I need to talk deeper for Gundam. Do yeah. you intend? Yeah. That's fine, yeah. Okay. Ah, that's probably a good idea. She looks like the type that's easily manipulated. Do you intend? <laughs> oh! Plus, Monomi and Monokuma totally have a rivalry going on. <laughs> Well, it's a pretty one-sided rivalry. Are you okay? But will you really be okay, Chiaki? I still think it's dangerous. It's gonna be fine. I'll be fine. If it get, if things get dangerous, I'll just run away as fast as I can using the Joe Star secret Joe Star yes. technique. Yes. <laughs> run away. Okay. Well then, I'll be going now. What is this feeling? I feel somewhat uneasy. It's not like I have a bad feeling about this, but something feels <gasps> off. So so it's all settled, right? Then then can we? <laughs> You're right. Let's begin. He starts eating. Oh. All right. Oh my gosh. <laughs> so the banquet has finally commenced. <laughs> <laughs> you better keep me entertained. Well, uh, what? <laughs> and with that, the party started. The party hardy. They all started partying hardy. What the? Why? Now that I think about it, I still don't understand why hey. we're even having a party in the first okay, place. We got, we got... I freaking can't remember her name. Hold on. Akane. Akane, you got Mikon, you got Kazuichi, Sonya, Nevermind, and Teru Teru. Yes. Okay, so that's, I, I'm close to kind of remembering ish some of their names. But whatever the reason, everyone seems to be having fun. Hey, are we good? Can I finally eat? You're already eating. <laughs> I, I can't stop. <laughs> I can't stop my hands from shoving food in my face! Yeah, I don't like Akane. Yeah, she's a little bit, uh, chao uh, psychotic, right? Is that is that one of the words? Is that, I don't know, what would you call her? <laughs> I don't know. She's just, she's Akane. Of course you can't stop. These are the world's tastiest party dishes, after all. And then you got stupid Mikon, like, smiling like, ugh. No matter how full you feel, you can't help but continue eating such exquisite delicacies. God, the food actually looks pretty good. It does look really good. I want to eat Terra Terra's food. That is what I cook. The world's tastiest dishes. That's rather scary. Why? If you're not eating? Well, then I'm going to eat all this by myself. I'll make lots more in the kitchen, and then I'll bring it all out here, okay? What a nice guy. <laughs> He's nice in terms of food. Hey, everyone. <laughs> He's nice guys. when it comes to his own food. Yeah, I want it, yeah. Wow, that sounds wonderful. Please do. Oh my god. Snap, snap. <laughs> Alright. <laughs> Snappity, snappity. This feels weird. When I first came to this island, watching everyone have fun was so frustrating. But now, it feels reassuring. We're actually friends who fight together. Friends who've developed a sense of unity. Ah, eh, for now. Anyway. <laughs> Until people start killing each other. <laughs> hmm? Nekomaru, did something happen? <laughs> uh, okay. The, the party's just started, but I must return to my cottage. Come on. Don't be foolish. I won't allow such selfish actions. Don't stop me. Don't stop me, Byakua. There comes a time when a man knows he's gotta go. If I don't go now, it would be a shame me at, uh, t shame, it would shame me as a man. <laughs> Crap in my pants would totally shame me as a man! <laughs> so he was talking about the toilet. What? If you need to use the bathroom, there's one in this old building. Why do you need to go back to your cottage? I I've been trying to use it as many times, but the door just won't open at all. What? What is this blasphemy? <laughs> but now, what now? Impossible! But my hellhound earring has disappeared! It, did it vanish into subspace? <laughs> what? <laughs> Calm down, you probably just dropped it somewhere. Oh crap, I'm gonna crap in my <laughs> pants! <laughs> this is a perfect Shut word. up, don't you dare. <laughs> hey, is it really all right if I eat all this? You might have to go to the Don't be an idiot, make sure you leave some for me. <laughs> come on! Hey, Byakua, everyone, come on, I'm gonna take a picture. What a what what picture? A picture of him freaking crapping his pants? Say cheese! Say All cheese. right, say cheese! Oh no, he's gonna. So why does she say just kidding when she's taking? 
Hey, why can't you act a little more mature? What? Beep beep. What, what was that sound just now? Oh, it's his poopy pants. He's gonna poop. Oh no. It's it's, it's a giant explosion of poop. <laughs> Sorry, that's gross. Like, but that's the beep beep. Wait, what? Huh? It's dark all of a sudden. Oh no, somebody crashed the party. <gasps> it's a blackout. Blackout? A blackout? I can't see anything. In that instant, as we stumbled around in the darkness, our fear swallowed us up like a food. It's Flood. Black. My future is pitch black. Oh, what? The sounds of screams and frantic footsteps rang throughout the dark dining hall. And were immediately swallowed up by another sound. Everyone, crawl down! We gotta stay calm in a situation like this! Ah, don't step on my feet! What the hell? What's going on here? Because the windows were entirely covered, the blackout surrounded us in, with complete darkness. Complete darkness, therefore, no matter how long I wait, there's no way my eyes will adjust. This is... Blasphemy! Oh, oh wait, what? Turn the damn lights on! I can't eat like this, you know! You guys? Where are you? <laughs> Wasn't the blackout just in the kitchen? Where are you? Is the breaker overloaded? Oh, this is where the death happens, obviously. Hold on a sec. I'll go along the wall and do something about it. Within the darkness, we fer fer fervently, we fervently waited to be released from our fear. We anxiously waited, and after a while, it finally <gasps> zap zap. Oh my God! Uh, at that moment, when the lights in the dining hall finally turned back on, a shocking scene unfolded before our eyes. Okay, so. We got a couple characters that we don't like. We got Gundam, luckily. Uh, okay. Oh, I don't know what's gonna happen. Th that is... Mikan's disappearance had been compromised. <gasps> I'm sorry! I missed again! I can't look at that. Really? Why is she still alive? Why? She's she's one person I don't care about living. Oh my god. Please don't, please don't look at me. I mean I don't care about dying, sorry. I'm not trying to. God. I'm just trying to click. I can't take this at all. God, no. 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 No, it's not. Stop. 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 Please forgive me. She's snapping shots. Why does she land like that? Why does she land the most inappropriate Never position? Mind. I think it would be best if no. we help her already. That's disgusting. Like why? Ew. It's <laughs> <laughs> so sorry. Hey. Yeah, from now on, just be careful. <laughs> Thank you. Freaking god, man. Mm. Uh, I'm glad the lights are back on here too. Yay! So you were the one who fixed the breaker, Kazuichi. You were unusually useful this time. Oh my god. Well, no, I couldn't find my way to the office with the circuit, break huh? circuit breaker. Uh, then why are the lights back on? <laughs> who knows? Are you stupid? Don't who knows me. You're so useless. Arg, it's not my fault, you know. There's no way I could have found my way to the office in that darkness. Oh my. Oh my. What happened? Sonia, did something happen? Uh, no, Byakuya was missing. Did he go somewhere? Uh, eh? Byakuya? Oh my god. We immediately looked around the dining hall. Sure enough, Byakuya, who promised he would lead us in situations like this, was nowhere to be found. Huh? Th that's weird. He was here earlier, right? Oh my god, don't tell me. Don't you tell me. Stop um, that. Dylan, he can't. Stop it. Stop it. Stop it. No. Um, <laughs> No! He's not- he's- where is he? Where's Byakuya? He's dead! You gotta find him, Nolan! He's dead! You gotta find him! No! You gotta find him! Just read it. Did he run off somewhere during the blackout? Gotta find him! We gotta find him! Gotta find Byakuya in the- that pitch blackness? He- hey. I'm- I'm a little worried. We would split up and go look for clues, gang. <laughs> go look for him. It, I'll look in the storage room so you can ask to check the entrance, Hajime. Yeah, got it. No. For now. Then I guess I'll look at the office. Then... I shall go look at, around the hallway. Oh, uh, I'll wait here since I'm kind of in the middle of eating anyway. 
I mean, Teru Teru could be dead. Where's uh, Teru Teru? Well, where's, uh, where's... Fuyuhiko! Exactly. See? We okay. don't know if it's Byakuya. Well, ha, I hope she's, not. She's still gonna eat while this is going on. She's still gonna eat while this is going on? Uh, I'm not... <laughs> Uh, I must bathroom. Heck, it could be Pecco. I, I must man up and check the bathroom. I don't understand this man up thing. Jeez. Jeez. Mr. Ham Hands ran away because there was an itty bitty blackout. <laughs> Such a shameful leader. If I find him, I'm gonna finger flick him in the face as punishment. What? What kind of punishment is that? He's not gonna let you. Even so, where did Byakua go? Um, I believe I have to check the entrance. I'm pretty sure Shiaki was there. The entrance, right. <sighs> Let's do it. Um, is it... Uh... Oh, frick. Yeah, entrance. Okay. Well, exit is entrance. <laughs> I don't know. Yeah, it must be. Okay. Oh, Shiaki's oh. not dead. Oh, thank the lord, man. Well, she's alright. I don't know. Usami's not dead? I'm joking. <laughs> Shiaki and Monami were standing in front of the entrance. I guess they're watching out for Monokuma. Huh? Huh? Hajime, what about the party? Huh? What? It's not done yet, right? I haven't even joined in yet. Hey, uh, hey, Shiaki, did you happen to see Byakuya pass by here? Byakuya? Nope, I didn't. But what happened to Byakuya? There was a sudden blackout inside the old building, and Byakuya vanished during that time. So, we thought he might have gone outside, but... Nope, nobody came out. If nobody came out, does that mean he's still inside? If that's the case, we might have missed each we might have missed each other. I think. That's what I think. Go look for him. Go look for Byakuya. Uh, yeah, where is he? Uh, Hajime, how'd it go? Well, when I talked to Shiaki, she said he didn't go outside. That's th that's weird. No one was inside the storage room either. He wasn't in the kitchen, obviously. Okay, Terra is Tero, not dead. fine. Mm. Okay. No one is. No one was in the That's office. Strange, no? Nobody was in the office. That's weird. Huh? What about Pecco? I thought she was supposed to be guarding that area. Hey. Oh gosh. Well, actually, not even Pecco huh? was there. Uh, Pecco's gone too. Oh no. Maybe, maybe those two took advantage of the blackout to have themselves a major makeout session in the bathroom. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, I I would hope, but I'm sorry, that's weird. But like, I, so nobody died. Okay. <laughs> totally, to truly outrageous. <laughs> hmm. Hmm. Um. Did something happen, Akane? Smells. Well, Danny. Uh, well, Danny, if you smell something. Wait, we partially digested food is absorbed by the uh, small intestine. It's decomposed by bacterial release and dies. I if she die, if she does not die in this game. I hate this game. I, I swear, if she does not die, I'm sorry that's rude, but like, honestly, screw her. <laughs> what do you mean I'm doing it because it's intestinal trap, but whatever, whatever cannot be absorbed is excreted from the anus. Yes. What? What? The those are me uh, mechanics of farting, but farting isn't something to be embarrassed about. Like Ew. That. No, I'm, I'm not talking about that. It smells like blood. Blood? Iron. Oh gosh, she can smell that? She's like a freaking wolf, dude. Yeah. <laughs> Alright. As Akane's nose furry. twitched like a beast, she suddenly pointed. She's a furry. furry. It's coming from over there! A table. At the very back of the dining hall. <gasps> That's where Fuyuhiko or Byakuya could be. Dylan, if it's Byakuya, it's I'm done. It can't be Byakuya. I'm done. It can't be, but it probably is. No. It's probably Fuyuhiko. It's probably- it's gotta be. The smell of blood. It's gotta be. When the world is- is at the table. It's under- under there! Under the table? I dash toward the table in the back, reached out toward the tablecloth. Please. And then I stopped. Is this nervousness fear? Wh why? Why am I nervous? It can't be. It obviously can't if it's, be. If it's- if he had to live throughout th that entire game just for nothing, I swear, it wouldn't make any sense for him to die. It wouldn't. It wouldn't. It wouldn't. There's no way that's gonna happen. With a shout, I grabbed the tablecloth and flipped it back in one go.
do 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 why? He couldn't die. He can't. He's Biakua. He's Biakua. He's Biakua. I can't. Why? He, is there any reason? There's no. There isn't because he's Biakua, man. There's there's no. Then I shouldn't have even played the last game anyway because that's just a waste. Like, oh my God. Just read. I'll never forget what I saw. God. What I saw, I saw the ultimate Nephilim progeny, Byakuwa Togami, already dead and beyond recognition. God, this is terrible. This is so dumb. It's stupid. God, I'm just. I, oh my God! Like. Biyaku, yeah, why, why is Biyaku yet? I just stood there, horrified, as showers of screams rang out behind me. As I gazed quietly at the body of my former friend. Why? Wh wh why? What is this? What is this? God. Hey, 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 hey. It, it's impossible. Me? Don't mess with me. This must be some kind of mistake. It is a mistake uh, from the developer's standpoint. This. Can't be real blood, right? It's gotta be something like jam or sauce. Cause if not, this. What the hell? Good gracious, things quickly took a turn for the worse. My, my, now this is interesting. On this tropical paradise known as Shabuak Island, the very first murder has finally taken place. Murder? Could it be? Hold on. Does this mean. Of course! Byakuwa was killed by one of you! Of course! If you look at the body, you can tell instantly he was obviously murdered. <laughs> look! He has such a horrible expression on his face, don't you think? A face filled with regret that his life was ended by force, all thanks to someone's selfish desires. Do you have a dying face such as this? If this isn't murder, then what the heck could it be? Hmm. Byakuwa was most likely sacrificed by someone who really wanted to leave this island. Lies. It's all lies. You're lying that he was murdered. Murdered. The moment I screamed that word. I, f I feel his pain because he's Byakuwa and he can't die. What? He's invincible. He is invincible. He's invincible. <laughs> God. A oh. thick, muddy feeling of despair swelled within he my was body. the only thing that I get grasped from the last game, man. But now he's gone. Which means that... That I've accepted the fact that Byakuo was murdered. I can't! We can't accept that! What is this? What is this? Is that really Byakuo? Why? Why did this happen? Why Byakuo? I know! Why him? I see, I see. It appears Fuyuhiko is the only one who isn't here. What are you gonna do? So, in the spirit of keeping everyone on the same page, how about we do this the usual way? Ding dong, bing bong. La 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 la. A body has been discovered. Now then, after a certain amount of time has passed, the class trial will begin. Class trial? Hey. Um... I've already explained this to you, right? If one of you gets murdered, the rest of you have to debate who you think is the blackened. You're... you're telling us to figure out who the killer is? Correct. That's right! From this point on, you guys must investigate and uncover the blackened culprit! It's possible. It, it can't be. Someone actually killed... there's no way! <laughs> if you make an outburst like that, you'll end up being a suspect. That's... I, I won't believe it. I, one of us killed Byakuwa? There's no way something as hopeless as that would ever happen. No, no, 
Oh no! If you're actually thinking that that way, it means you guys are already being conned by the killer. <laughs> come on, come on, let's hurry up and begin. As impassioned, life-risking battle between you guys and the Blackened, and it's already started. It started the moment one of you plotted to kill someone. Hey, hey, hey what are you saying? Yeah. Everyone, please, you cannot, you should not believe what Malakuma says. <laughs> No matter how much you interfere, there is only ever one truth. On my grandfather's, On my grandfather's name. You have a grandpa? On my grandfather's, <laughs> On my grandfather's grave. Grave? Your grandpa is dead? What happened to him? On my grandfather's, On my grandfather's plane. What? Emergency. What happened to your grandpa? Did his plane crash? <laughs> what? Mm, I don't even know where to begin at this rate. You ain't my comedy. What? Anymore. What the? Yeah. Oh my god. How does he not care about Biakua? How does he not care? I mean, he's Biakua. They've. Well, they haven't gotten along, but. Uh, oh, wait. Did you see that? Not. The yeah, stunning but. display of power. Defy your big brother, and I will show you no mercy. I will harden my heart and teach you a lesson you won't soon forget. Uh, oh, Frank. If you, if only I have my magic stick, I'll be able to fight against, back against Monokuma. Yeah, yeah, whatever. Let's just leave the whiny rabbit loser alone and get on with the investigation. Now then, in the spirit of lovely doubt and lovely deception, put your heart and soul into investigating. Yahoo! I wish you the best of luck! And with that, Monokuma vanished, leaving those of us who were grief-stricken alone with our despair. What does this mean? I don't understand this at all. A search for Biaki was killer. Why did it have to turn out like this? What's going on? Ugh, give me a break. Why do I have to be involved in this horrible situation? Um, uh, um, you can't you doubt each other because you're all friends. But Mr. Ham Hands really did get killed, right? And if we don't find who the killer is, we're all going to get killed, right? right? That's being said. That's being said. I cannot abide by this. Now that I have finally made friends, there's no way I can doubt them. Seriously? Do you even listen to what I said? It doesn't matter if you can abide by this or not. We gotta do this to survive, right? Then we have no choice but to do it. Yeah. She acts like Celeste a little bit. Yeah. To survive. No, friend scouting friend is a major no-no. Shut up! Alright, shut up! Just go away already, you useless piece of trash! Ha ha wa wa ha! Threats are scary! Do we really have to do what? it? No, I don't want to do something like that. No! I don't want to do it either, it's so scary! You should have been the one to die, Mekon! However... However, it is just as Hiyoko said. If we're going to get killed for not doing it, then we must do it. Oh my gosh. But still, I can't believe one of us got ki uh, killed Byakua. There's no way I can believe it, there's no way! No, so for that reason, I know, I agree with you. Like, who could kill that guy? Yep. I'll do it. I'll investigate Byakuya's death. I'll do it to my best to prove there's no killer among us. There's no need to deceive or doubt each other. That we get, we need to fight and not There's ourselves. No mistake. But which, that is which is trying to crush us. This despair. This hopeless reality. That's the real enemy we need to Fuyuhiko fight. Fuyuhiko is the suspect, is a suspect. I just highly doubt he did it because obviously it's too obvious. But I don't know, he might have. If I'm going to survive this... Then I have to fight it. Ah, uh, before you start, can I say something? Well? In, in closed circle detective games, the player usually has to decide on who's going to guard the crime scene. What should we do? I well, I'm like an Alaskan, too. Alright. Oh, yeah. It would be bad if the killer destroyed the evidence and got away with it. You destroyed the evidence! Pointing. Look over there! That big, bulky, brawny guy is perfect for the guard dog job. Huh. Oh! <laughs> what the heck? What happened? That guy has a sensitive heart despite his looks. I is that what that means? Hey. Uh, I can be the one who watched the crime scene. I don't have enough confidence to investigate the body, and it's not like I have the brains either. Oh, I'll just stay by Byakuya's side. That's the least I can do. That's what guard duty is, right? <laughs> but, but hey, well. Uh, 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 I do my best. I do my best. I do my very best. Get you get your way. Yes. Yeah, I'm stupid. I have medical training, so if it's not too much trouble, I can perform my autopsy, please. 
I hope he, I hope she was the one who killed him because I want her to die. Okay. So, uh, anyway, so you're going to stay as well? Is that okay? <laughs> and what specifically should we be doing now? I have no idea. It's pretty obvious we're all just amateurs. Going through each grain of sand on a beach just to find a clue would be a waste of time. The only one ones who can do that are the police. There's no way amateurs like us would be dead to do that. So let's first rely on our intuition. We'll start off from improve. We'll start from there and prove that none of us could have killed Biakuo. But to perform an autopsy on your friends, how cool! But I have no choice, right? There's no way I could. Do something that's that declined, right? I won't believe. I won't believe it. But that Byakuwa got killed? I don't believe it, that at all. Uh, <laughs> but fine, I'm in. You are right. If you are to survive, this is our only this path. Worse. Something like this is the only thing we can do in order to stay alive. Finding out who the killer is, that's our only hope for survival. Something like this is hope? Even so. I still gotta do it. Justice will be served to be Akua. Hold on. Ta da! You thought it was time for the investigation, but. The Monokuma file! Oh. Just as I thought, you amateurs need this, right? What the hell is a Monokuma file? Jeez, explaining the rules all the time really breaks my bones. Well, it's not like I have bones in the first place. Like, I don't even make. Don't even make me say such lame jokes. Let's see, the Monokuma file contains precise and detailed information regarding the dead body. I've brought it to you guys so you can smoothly proceed with the investigation. I'm such a nice guy. I'm so nice, I want to be known as Mother Teresa of the mascot world. Nice to say. Um, nice you say. You're just a selfish meanie. My, my, my! Monoly, Monomi, the meaningless mascot. You're still here? Don't push me to a meaningless mascot genre. Come on, let's go. Your turn is already up. Hurry up and get the hell out of here with me. Ouchie, don't pull my ears. We're gonna come off. They're gonna come off. They're finally gone. The Monokuma file, huh? Anyway, I guess I should look over it just in case. Oh, so much. Okay. Okay, he's dead, right? Oh, why did they have to go and kill him? The victim's body was discovered in the dining hall of the old building near the Hotel Mirai. The estimated time of death was 11.30 p.m. The victim was repeatedly stabbed over 10 times between the throat and the abdominal region, region resulting in death. Aside from that, the body has, has no other external injuries, and no chemicals such as poison were detected. So, the Akiwo is really dead. Damn it! You promised there wouldn't be one, one, there wouldn't even be one victim. Why'd you end up being one? And now, I'll never know what you were going to say to me. Oh no. I cannot talk to others about my past. I suspect that my skeptical nature is partly to blame. First flashback. Distrusting others and being distrusted in return, for a long time my life has been a living hell. It was inevitable that I would end up this way. Oh, Byakuo. In the end, what did it even mean? Could it be? Even so, if there really is a traitor, isn't that just gosh darn awful? Pretending to be your ally and tricking you guys. Can't be helped if someone like that gets killed, right? A traitor. No way. Just because he said a lot of serious things, it doesn't mean he was the traitor. But what am I thinking? Oh wow, Monokuma File 1 has been added to the truth section. Okay, wow. Anyway, we need to carefully examine everything. That's right. I need to do it. If we're going to survive this, we need to do it. I have to prepare myself for the worst. I have to do it. Okay, guys. The worst possible situation would be the Ultimate Flume progeny, progeny dying. Dying. How could he have died? I don't get it. I don't get it. It's not possible. Whoever killed him, they don't deserve to die? But they deserve to be locked up forever, because that's Byakuwa, and he was going to change the world for the better. For the better. But what happens? Why? The leader... Why? The leader always dies. No! First Taka, now Byakuwa. No! No! It just can't 
be happening. This can't. It's Byakuwa from the last game where he survived and just to loot, just to die in the first chapter. The first chapter of the second game. Why? Why did they write that in? I mean, they could have at least given him a couple chapters or something. More character development to just make it better. I mean, not better, but... God, forget it. Just, just, just a little tip to them. I don't know. Anyway, I'm a little mad about this entire chapter. I hate this chapter already. I like the game. I just hate this chapter because of this reason. Uh, anyway, guys. The next episode, we're going to be investigating and then the cla first class trial. So, uh, I'm annoyed. It sucks. I'm sure you guys are too if you haven't seen the game. Uh, anyway. Hope you liked the video. Comment down below. Leave a like, subscribe, and I'll see you on the next adventure of Nolan's Ark. Bye!